Good afternoon, Pepper people. This is Rhett Griffin. Welcome to Grizzly Heat. Wanted to get on here earlier. Had to go have another test done. Um, dealing with stuff, uh, setting up appointments for my for uh, Papa Grizz, for doctor, you know, stuff. Life, guys. Life. Just a bunch of life stuff. Um, no results in my test. Don't know yet. We'll get it. Till then, we will endeavor to persevere. Endeavor to persevere. That's what we'll do. Um, anyway, I'm super excited about making this video. Um, so, Miss Megan and Miss Rachel from Silver Creek Pepper Company. Um, I sent them something. They sent me something back. That's how that works um, with them. Really cool people. Really appreciate it. Let me clarify something. If I send you something, I'm not respect. I'm not expecting anything back. Okay. If you can, that's cool. If not, no worries. Life happens. Things happen. If I send something to you, it's out of the goodness of my heart. Um, I, I I remember a while back. Um, I kind of um, upset somebody by doing that, and it wasn't in my intention. I never want anyone to think that I require or request something um, in return for you sending me something or vice versa. Um, it just doesn't, I'm not that, that way. If I give you something, it's not as good as my heart. I don't want anything back. If you want to give me something, I'll take it. That's my love language. But if you don't want to, or it's not in your ability, I will tell you right now, I am not going to think less of you or um, bad mouth you, um, you know, that whole, oh, I sent me something and sent me nothing back. That's not who I am. I don't have time for all that drama. I'm here um, to help and send, you know, if I can send something to somebody that I think they'd like, I'm going to do it. No stipulations. I don't want anything back unless you feel like you can and you're able to. There you go. So anyway, they sent me a box full of pods. Um, got them in this. This is a uh, fridge smart Tupperware from uh, Keith Nichols. Um, his significant other sells um, Tupperware. So anyway, you guys take a gander in here. Look inside of here. They sent me this <clears throat> flat rate box with these amazing looking pods. I've seen some of them on Instagram, but I've never seen them in real person. I don't look them up. I don't even know what all they are. I have no idea how hot some of them are. I do know what some of them are. Some of them are hot, and I know what some of them are, but most of them, except for like, I mean, I know what a, um, you know, a BBG apocalypse. I know what those are. I haven't eaten them all, but I uh, I got a Prima Tali in there too, so I know what that one is. But besides that, like these are exotics I've never seen before. Super excited to eat these. Um, Miss Megan, Miss Rachel, Silver Creek Pepper Company. You guys reach out to them, okay? They have an Instagram page. They also have a Facebook page. Make sure you reach out to them. They're amazing. Um, I can tell you the passion that goes into growing these pods is very, very high because of the quality of them. They're phenomenal looking pods. They're labeled really good. Just gave me a nice list so I know what's happening. Really nice letter. It says, Rhett, we appreciate you. Thank you for being a kind human. Megan and Rachel, Silver Creek Pepper Company. They've been a supporter of the channel from the beginning. Um, <clears throat> their Ramblon Rose, still one of my favorite tinctures. I gotta get another bottle of that because I haven't had it in a long time. You guys watch the channel for a long time. You notice I used to be one of my favorites, still is, and I'm out. I just haven't got any more. Um, great company, great people. That's enough of this. It's time to eat some pods. So here's what I have here. I have a Kang Star Lemon Starburst. This pod intrigued me when I saw it in there. Kind of looks like a bonnet or something, right guys? Never had it before, but the way it was shaped, I saw Johnny do this with a similar one. I figured I would cut it this way so you guys can see. Check that out. This thing is so stinking cool. Like, I don't even know. It's almost too pretty to eat. I mean, it's just a beautiful shaped, amazing. I mean, you guys, straight check that out. It's just phenomenal. I thought it was really cool. Sorry. Might not be that cool to you, but it's really cool to me. I thought it was really cool. 
Um, and then I have, so this is a Kang Star uh, Lemon Starburst. Burst. Um, never eaten one before. Um, figured it'd be really cool. One of the first ones I'm gonna eat out of it. So I also have um, this one, which is a Pimenta Jolokia Ice, or Jolokia, um, what depends on how you say it, Holokia, I've heard of different ways, Jolokia Ice, that's how I like to say it. Uh, so it's a, a Pimenta Jolokia Ice. This is a cool pod, guys. Look at the colors in this thing. Just really cool shape. I cut it open. It's got some nice oils inside of it. You know, I've never eaten one of these either. And then to wrap it all off, the trifecta is the, is um, this one is a Borg 9 peach. I have seen some people eat some Borg 9s. I've never seen a Borg 9 in person, let alone a peach. Now you guys look at this pod, just really cool. Now, I mean, the colors on these, look at that purple in there. If you can catch that, just phenomenal. I mean, this is really cool pods. You know, I call these exotics because, I mean, most of the time you see them, you see yellows, you see reds, maybe some mustards, some browns, chocolates, caramel, caramel, however you want to say it. Um, but I've never seen some of these in person, only pictures. Really cool. I love the peach with the purple in it. This has a similar look to it. Check out the colors of this one. Just really cool. So... Miss Megan, Miss Rachel, thank you so much. Um, without further ado, it's time to get some pods on, but I do want to take a sip, cleanse the palate. Um, yeah. Um, oh, I'm going to be back. I got to make a video this afternoon. I will try to make a quick one. It won't be a long one, but I definitely have to, I have to promote something this afternoon. Um, but right now, Enough of the stalling. So this is the Kang Star um, Lemon Starburst. So, like I said, I'm really excited to eat this. Um, just amazing looking pod. So, this is Red Griffin Grizzly Heat. These pods are from Silver Creek Pepper Company. You guys hit them up. They have flat rate boxes. They have uh, products. Um, amazing, amazing people. Um, so... Thank you very much. Stay spicy, pepper people. Really fruity. Sweet. Fruity. Juicy pod. Wow. That was tasty. Some heat, mouth burn building. not overbearing if you're not a chili head you won't want to eat it but if uh if you like chasing the heat and eating hot stuff it's not um not gonna kill you It'll let you know you ate something hot though you can feel it i got a good mouth burn tip of the tongue edges of the tongue a little bit in the lips yeah i said not overbearing but really really good heat this is a uh, pimenta jolokia ice See what this one's all about. This one's a little sweet too. There's a season of placenta. Let's see what if it changes. Wow, that was good. It 
So that lemon starburst definitely had some citrus tones in it. Very sweet, juicy. This one didn't have the citrus, but it was sweet. Um, just a touch of bitter right at the end. That's it. Um, yeah, this is a good one. That was really good. Um, got that heat ramping, that uh, ghost pepper, Jalokia ramp. Definitely feel a little bit in the back of my throat, so I can feel it climbing. Yep. Typical ghost pepper fashion. Good pod. Now this one I've never eaten. Never eaten a regular one, a peach one. This is 75. This is a Borg 9 peach. Um, look inside of this one. It's got some decent oils in it, guys. There's like, you can't really see it. I'm not even going to try to show the camera. But there looks like there's a river. Let me come around here. There's a river right in here. The light's not going to do it justice. Um, it looks like it's a vein. And then there's little droplets above it. So I'm imagining it'd be pretty hot. So, four nine peach. I didn't look any of these up, Scoville. I'm gonna eat them anyway, it doesn't matter. So, that one's sweet too, with a hand of floral. Not super floral, just a hand. When it's sweet with just a little bit, it's not bad. Not getting any bitterness out of it. Wow. Those were three unique pods, totally different. Last two looked similar, tasted different, burned different. Enjoyable. Got some heat though. Heat level for me right now, probably about a three. Yeah, probably about a three. I feel a little bit in my throat. Got that ghost pepper, Jalokia burn. Yeah, probably about a three, three and a half. Well, anyway, I'm gonna wrap this up. Uh, 13, geez, these videos are getting long. Um, <clears throat> thank you, Silver Creek Pepper Company, Miss Megan, Miss Rachel. You guys are awesome. Always supporting the channel from the beginning. Um, I love you guys. Beautiful pods. I can tell the passion you put into growing these pods. Um, really fun to eat. Um, you guys, enjoy the rest of your day. It's Friday. Be nice to someone. And as always, stay spicy, pepper people.